So what are we doing? Well, I think we just thought about it. Yeah. Because the, the tree trimmer is coming tomorrow morning, mm -hmm. like at eight. So this tree, they're just cutting it and setting it all on the ground. So we have to do all the cleanup. But if you remember, Tractor has a brush shredder. So she's been sitting a minute, <laughs> a few years, and then set a few months over here. Yeah. So why not just start it up, get her ready to shred brush? So this video is, uh, will she start? Yeah. Will tract her start? Start. get a webbed foot dog no they, they throw did. sand and stuff yeah so this tree is in the way of the power lines so basically Edison has come through and said we are replacing some poles on your property and uh, this tree is in the way so they are going to cut it down for us and leave everything behind which is okay We'll take the firewood because we'll use it for a fire. And we do have a brush shredder well, or tractor. Yeah, we have one, but we've never used it or don't know if it works or if tractor even runs. No. But, yeah, we got one. We got one. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so what better time to try to get tractor to run than right now? So... She's been on the to-do list. Oh, it just got sped right to the top. Too. Yes. catch it in one of our last videos we actually went and picked up tracked her and uh, it shows us picking her up and getting the implements that came with her including the shredder um, brush shredder and she's pretty much just been sitting here we've just been really busy and haven't gotten a chance or had a need to get her going because we have tracked her to do all of our major work but the brush shredder will not work on tractor, tractar. Jeez, too many tractor names. The Wait till we get a backhoe. <laughs> <laughs> the brush shredder will not work on tractar because it's not a PTO, whereas tractor has a PTO. So we need to get her going so we can get rid of all the brush from the oak tree. What's funny is we went and looked at a backhoe the other day, but <laughs> we decided not to get it. But we're like, ah, uh, that shows we're looking pretty hard. <laughs> like we already have one tractor that we haven't even started. I don't know if it'd be a good idea to get another <laughs> yeah, one. Too. Then next thing you know, you got three, four, yeah. and you got a yard of tractors that don't run. You know? <laughs> we don't want to be those people. So it's time to figure out if she will start. I say we just blow her off, take off the hood. Okay. And then get a can of WD-40 and just spray everything. everything. Oh, it's like froze, that's throttle. Look, that's like so stiff. And then this was all froze up. So we'll just go around everything. Get that carburetor linkage working, get the hood off and then put some fuel in it. Pretty much start it. And then we're going to be like, oh shoot, we need tires. We need tires. I'm confident in her though. And it's got this support right here. Yep. Okay. 
so when we got tracked her, she came with a service repair manual and then also a little box of goodies. <clears throat> Or RPMs or... Mm. So. But there was some points and stuff like that, so... This is what we need to get her going. Alright, just... Just, double, just blow her off and double D40. Alright, I hope it'll be that easy. Man, I've been waiting to spray this thing down for, with double D for a long time. Yeah. Today's the day. Today's the day. I'm like excited to spray it down with that, but... I gotta start with this. Yeah, she's got a little rust in there. So I'd like to like try to suck that little pile out before it, uh, you know, falls in there. Yeah. And so there's a lot in there. <laughs> Try to get out as much as we can. Yeah, we don't want that last little sprinkle to yeah. plug the top. This is supposed to be a clear tube. Why does it need to be clear? So you can see the fuel. Ooh. You don't have like a fuel gauge. Okay. It's like a sight tube, you know what I mean? Like, oh, get low. Oh, okay. That's cool. Wish mine had that. Yeah, no gauge. Yeah, it's just a sight tube. Okay. Pretty primitive, you know what I mean? Uh huh. Don't want to get her everywhere. What else? What else? All this throttle stuff that was the main. What about underneath here? Oh, yeah. Good, good eye. <laughs> Didn't see that little. Oh, oh. she oh. Oh, oh. oh we got something here. Okay, okay. Man, that was it. That was the key. You're good. <laughs> Look at that yeah. thing. Exciting. <laughs> oh yeah, she's ready now. Whoop. You try to crank it or spin it over though, yeah, right? Off the bottom, off the bottom uh, pulley. Yeah, that was like a few months ago. I was just walking by it and I was like, I gotta know if it's stuck or not. So then I came and just pry barred it. I think I do have a little video clip of him trying to turn it over. Well, it's been here like what? Over a month. <laughs> I'll just see if the motor's stuck. Probably been a good idea right off the get. Probably would have been. It just make me feel good, you know, a month later about my purchase. Knowing that it ain't froze. And then I could just comfortably leave it here for another month <laughs> or longer. Especially if she's frozen. Well, if she's frozen, yeah. Then uh... she might just be yard art. <laughs> oh shoot! She's a little stuck. Well, she ain't frozen. Not anymore. <laughs> it was like half. It like tink, and then it like you know. Then it gave. Yeah. So. Right on. Motorola. Oh, I, did, a, I, did, I, I didn't know Motorola. I thought that was a phone. I mean, it's some quality Japanese stuff right here. <laughs> you know, it really is if you think about that. Yeah, Apple, that's, that's you good, know. Good parts. You yeah, know? yeah. Motorola. Huh. With good, whoa, that's like so much easier already. Wow. This is the last one that I was worried about. Yeah. Oh, it is amazing what some deadly D40 dude, will do. Dude, that's good right there. She's ready to go. Like nothing now. Beautiful. Oh, and now it's like, 
I mean, really? We're ready to go. Sweet! Just start it up. <laughs> Back that out, hook a battery in it, and really crank her over. Some fuel and crank it over, see what happens. We found a key, right? So this isn't the key that came with it. No, but it worked. So, uh, yeah. Send it. Yep. Man, these birds are so loud. Oh look, there's like a there's like a yellow conure type thing up in the tree. You see that? Oh, oh. Look at that. It's if like a bird, yellow conure. If your bird is missing, it's here. <laughs> it's in our tree. It's in our avatar tree. <laughs> what is it? It's like the tree of life. Tree of life. <laughs> this tree has so much life going on in it. There's beehives, which maybe that's not a good thing. <laughs> and birds and nests and out of there as possible, vacuumed out. Okay. Now fuel. Fuel. And uh, water. Water. Yeah. I mean that. That was promising. <laughs> that sounded. It sounded like good compression too. Yeah. Yeah. You know. I'm gonna say we just disconnect this and give her a little shot of a uh, starter fluid. Yeah. Then the bead around the bud. Tell us if we have a spark or not. Okay. Oh, did you see it come out the bottom gasket there? Oh. I'm going to say it needs a gasket right there. Hmm. Do you have any gasket maker? Oh, we go get some. Yeah, it still huffs out right there. Mm hmm So then when we try to start it, fuel will end up coming out right there, right? No, I think that... Uh, will be breathing too much air? Yeah. It's okay. just going to run like a little shitty. Okay. All right, but we can still that's attempt. Yeah. Okay, okay. That, yeah, that's gonna be just a little. Here, a little fuel. <laughs> no spark. <laughs> uh, I see a little spark in there. Okay. Let's just leave this for a minute. I think that that one thing is going to cause us a little trouble. A carburetor issue. Oh, oh, what? Oh, she's gonna run. <laughs> <laughs> it's quiet. Uh. <laughs> 
Yeah. All right, let's put some water. Okay. Take her to the next one. Oh my gosh, she like almost started. Yeah, she just dumped out the bottom. I don't see nothing so far. Drink that. <laughs> if it picks up that gas, you can run. I mean, she's already ran in my book. So I get this key to work. Might end up having to convert it to like a push button. No, I just buy like a little ignition. Oh, okay. Woo! Oh, she's getting fuel. Okay. But it's still wanting to pop. Oh, we're spraying out fuel over here. Out of the carburetor, look at that. Ooh. Yeah, floats are stuck. Is, okay. Is what I would say. Dang, she's gotten some fuel out. Yeah, she did. She wanting to run for <laughs> pumping fuel. Hey. It, it, it like this jet right here like petered out like the nastiest amount of uh. Yeah, the floats are stuck. We're gonna need a carburetor kit. Ah. Uh. No, I'm gonna tap on her and see okay. if we get her crank. But I don't want her to gush out fuel like that and catch fire you know what i mean like it was pouring fuel it out. was it was let's uh just check the oil real quick make sure it didn't milk up you know like oh from water maybe being in it yeah oh no she, and she's like looking right on point oh, yeah, a little yeah. bit looking good looking <laughs> good Yeah, when she started, that's what happened. She just way too much uh, fuel overflowing the bowl and everything. Are these sluice right here? I don't know. I was going to check those. Oh, no. Yeah, a little bit. I mean, you don't want to... Over tighten. Yeah, because they're probably going to swell up when now they got a little fuel. Or I'm at tear it apart. That feels so thin. <laughs> Mine on, on that tractor, you could be like, da, da, da. <laughs> it's like metal. This thing feels like paper thin. Let's try her again. All right. That was crazy. You can tell that there's like a lot of backfiring and stuff too. I bet you that that leak uh -huh. is gonna just take care of all of it. It probably just ran like crap and it was just like, eh, park that piece of crap. Oh, spewing float, out. Floats are straight up stuck. Mmm. Just stuck open. That's... But the fuel pump's pumping. Yeah, that's good. It's like yellow gas. It is. Out. It's nasty. Flushing the system right now. It's like I gotta just uh, get all that out, <laughs> and then it'll just come in. So basically, what Ronnie's doing is he's tapping the carburetor because there's floats in there that control how much fuel uh, is in there, and yeah, they like float on the gas. Yes. So he's trying to get them to unstick. So that way they will float properly and not just be... Shut off that fuel. Exactly. But obviously the gasket's got a hole there. And then when we shot it, is there's another right here. Yep. So she definitely needs yeah. a rebuild. We spent her. see it shooting out. No, it's not. But now we're not getting spark. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
All right, so she's not spewing out fuel. Looks like the floats aren't stuck anymore. Is it running right now? It's running. Oh, 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 oh she shoot. Didn't, she didn't like the gas. She was running. She just let her just sit there and warm up. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Give her a minute. What do you think, Arvin? You got another tractor to chase? Look for lizards? feels cold too though. Eh, she probably just hasn't gotten toasty yet. Yeah. Well, there's just a lot of pressure, but maybe it's just building pressure, you know. Yeah. I'm not going to worry about it. Yeah, she stopped leaking. I don't even know if my tractor has water. Right? <laughs> <laughs> so, so, I'll be cool. Yeah, it stopped leaking. Good. Stopped leaking yeah. too, so yeah. we're good. So, the carburetor stopped leaking. The floats came unstuck. Yeah, yeah. And we did have some water spewage out of the radiator, but... Building pressure, yeah. that stopped. Found a vacuum leak. So that'll probably help her run a little smoother too. I found a piece of hose. It was in the trash. <laughs> <laughs> it might, it might like a little junk pile at back. It's like on a piece of scrap metal. It's perfect. <laughs> Got a little blue on it, but. It's okay. I actually like turquoise, so, you know, that's fine. I'll take it. Oh, this thing fits good. Just gonna tie that right there later, and that'll be fine. Nice. So, pretty much, just gonna back it in the shop, and then, uh, Weight on parts, tires, thermostat, carburetor kit. Thank you. 